welcome to Tonic Studios. Today we're going to share with you our Woodland Buildables range. So for this project I am going to be using Harry Hedgehog and I'm also going to be using Betty Bunny. So this is a little picture frame I've made using our little Harry. He's a delightful little character. So I've just cut the body, I'm going to emboss it and then I'm going to do a spot of ink again. So I've just used a little bit of black, distre black soot distress ink and I've got a little bit of white magic distress ink as well, a little bit of chalk ink. So this is just the black on this one. I just wanted to give his little um, hedgehog spikes a little bit more colour. So I've already cut all the pieces ready and I'm going to do all my ink in to start with. So because this balloon is pale grey and I wanted a little bit of a, um, more of a highlight on it, I put a little bit of black on it first and then white on top. But with the other colours, because they're a bit darker, I've just used the white chalk ink. We've also got his hands and his feet. So I'm just popping a little bit of black soot on those just to highlight them. They're such cute little characters and you can give them a little personality all of their own just by moving some of the features and using some of the, the little icons from the other sets as well. With Harry the Hedgehog at the moment, he looks like a little boy with his tie. But with um, with Frankie Fox, she's got a beautiful bow. So you could put a bow on this one instead of the tie. So I'm just putting some 3D pads onto the, the body part, just to give it some dimension. I'm popping it into a frame and it's a 3D box frame. So I wanted as much dimension as I could get. So this is the little face and again I've popped some 3D foam pads on there. On the packaging all the parts for the animals are, are named. There's his little snout. And his little tummy. So the colours again could be varied. I just thought these colours would look nice in the little boy's room. So this is little nose. And these are his little ears. Even though they're small parts they're not too fiddly to put together and children would love playing with these. There's his little feet. And again his hands. All these are cut from Craft Perfect cardstock, which is 216 GSM. But they would cut thicker or thinner cardstock, depending on what project you wanted to make. I have cut fabric out to them, as long as you've got a stabiliser on the back. There's a little tie, which would make it a little boy's card, but you could either have a dicky bow, or you could put a bow in the hair which is from a Frankie Fox set. But this one is going to stay for a little boy. There's his little eyes. He looks like he's having a little sneeze or he's squinting in the sunlight to me. 
but the eyes on the other characters could be swapped because all the eyes are different. So again, that's where you can build in the different characteristics. There's his little tie. And that's him finished. So we're just going to put the frame together. And I've cut some, I've got a square backing card and I've used our circle layering die set for the circles. Again, I'm creating more dimension using the 3D foam pads. Just the balloons to go on now. And just play around with them. As I say, the little balloons are from the Betty Bunny collection. And it's also got the little string to hold the balloons in place. Pop the first balloon flat and then I'm putting some foam pads to 3D the other balloons. Just going to pop our little project into the frame. I think this would make a lovely baby gift. If you've enjoyed watching this video, follow us on YouTube and Facebook for more projects similar to this.